Hey guys, good morning. It's Mike. I uh, wanted to bring to you another video of uh, five different bezels that are shipping out today. Um, just want to go over these real quick. Not the best weather conditions today. I apologize for the bad lighting and uh, the wet concrete. Obviously, it's been raining, so it's not the most sunny day. This isn't going to be the best video, but I do want to put this out there so, again, we can show off the work. And two, so the people who actually paid me for these can... Uh, see their work that's actually been done to uh, what they paid for so pretty much what we have here are two of the slate gray dash pieces with uh, black bezels I've got a taupe dash piece here with a white carbon fiber bezel I'll show you that here in a little bit um, here we just have a single uh, double den primer gray bezel and this one is a actually a viper car uh, bezel that a gentleman sent to me and we modified and uh, it's just taped off sprayed primer and I'll come back to that in a moment also so first of all again this is the uh, the charcoal or slate gray dash piece uh, this one goes out to Joshua Redler uh, he's been waiting on this one it's just a um, again your standard double den uh, with a black bezel this one here the exact same again you know your charcoal slate gray dash piece almost a, a black color if you will uh, with a black bezel this one goes to Don Canton uh, I guess I'll go ahead and do this one I really wanted better light to show this to you guys uh, this goes out to James Williams um, this is his it's in a taupe uh, dash and um, this is the uh, the 3D dye knot white carbon fiber. It really pops in, in natural sunlight in uh, poor light conditions like these with overcast and stuff like that. It just really doesn't do this justice. But I uh, just want to show this off real quick. Uh, the Viper bezel. Uh, really admire these guys uh, for those cars. This goes out to George uh, Chacon. And uh, he has obviously a Viper car. Now he, we were originally talking about uh, wrapping this in a carbon fiber, but he's got some other interior pieces that he is going to have done at a local shop. Uh, so he has the rest of those pieces with him, which is why this is just in, in primer and nothing else. Uh, this one here goes out to Cynthia Rogers uh, out in Arizona, if I'm not mistaken. And she bought this for her husband, for, her, for his truck. She loves him just that much. I admire that type of wife but uh, that one is hers or his actually and so again just a little overview of the five bezels that we got now one of the things that I've recently uh, joined up with here is a local paint and body shop that's going to be doing some more in various different colors and themes palettes metallics pearls candy stuff like that um, since they have uh, a temperature control and, and dust free environment they're going to get to a little bit more advanced painting that we're going to provide for the customers and another thing that I'm set up with now is um, hydrographics or hydro painting uh, tons of designs that are now uh, able to be put on these so if you guys have something that you want imprinted onto the bezel let me know and I'll get a price quote set up for you guys but uh, again, the weather is what it is. I apologize to you guys, but just want to show these off. If you guys need something, feel free to inbox me on Yahoo. Uh, I mean, uh, Yahoo, YouTube, excuse me. Uh, hit me up on my uh, email, weedaho at hotmail.com. Find me on any one of the Dodge boards, eBay, um, things like that. Got a website coming. We're still in works on that. Trying to work out some small details as far as the checkout process and stuff goes. But... Other than that, I still got those Durangos and Dakota bezels in the shop. We got to get those out still. Um, so if you guys need something, just give me a call. Stay tuned. We got tons of more stuff coming out. And um, just really wish I could show you better on that one. But uh, anyway, I want to thank you guys for watching the video. And uh, y'all have a good morning.